What defines a hero? For Florida State softball player Kelly Hensley, the answer is simple. Just doing what you can do and sacrificing for your cause. Last year, Kelly was the hero for Florida State's season. Trailing by four in an elimination game in the regionals against South Alabama, Hensley stepped to the plate with the bases loaded. You know, not trying to do too much, just trying to stay within my game, not getting caught up in the moment, and um, just sticking with the routine and looking for a pitch I could do some damage with. Hensley delivered, blasting a grand slam off the scoreboard to tie the game. That game is, you know, certainly the it's probably the highlight of my career. It's the craziest game I've ever been in. Florida State would win in extra innings and advance to the Super Regionals for the first time since 2006. As a senior, Hensley and her teammates look to surpass last year's accomplishments. This year's been great. Obviously, we've been really successful on the field. It's you know kind of the dream way every senior wants to go out. You know, having one of your best years is your last year. Fourth one fielder number 23, Kelly Hensley. Florida State has already earned its highest ranking in the past 10 years and has its sights set on the postseason. For Kelly, it will be the last time she'll step on the field. After graduation, Kelly will begin medical school. I've wanted to be a doctor. It's been my dream since I was a little kid, you know, and uh, I came in here to college, you know, but that was what I wanted to play softball and I wanted to get to medical school. Kelly has succeeded on and off the field. As an exercise science major, she has been the softball team's recipient of the Golden Torch Award each of the last three years. It's an award that recognizes student athlete excellence in the classroom. She was also named the 2013 ACC Softball Scholar Athlete of the Year. She's competing at the top of her game in the classroom every day and then trying to compete at the top of her game out here in the softball field. And that's hard to balance sometimes, especially when you get into that later part of your career of school. As great as an asset Kelly is to the Florida State softball team, she decided to forego the opportunity to possibly play professional softball to serve a greater purpose. I commissioned this January and um, so I'm gonna be in the reserves for four years and then I'll get to go active duty with the Army after I graduate from medical school. Enlisting in the military, Kelly joins a list of Hensleys that have served their country. Her father served in the Air Force for 21 years and her sister is a captain in the Army. It's helped them be successful softball players, that kind of discipline that we you know, try to instill in the military and they brought that to the softball field. I think it's made them successful in, in both arenas. With my dad being in the military and my sister, you know, I've always kind of considered the military option. And once I got into med school, you know, I think you know, it was a great way to, for me to you know, be able to afford to go to med school, school as well as you know, getting the opportunity to serve you know, some of the greatest people in our country. Kelly was sworn into the Army January 29th in front of her teammates, friends, and family. She'll be a second lieutenant following graduation from medical school. It was a really awesome experience that um, my sister being a captain in the, in the Army got to swear me in, so she got to do my oath of office. So that was, that was a really special moment for us, I think. It was just a privilege to have her do that. And it was a special moment for our family. You know, I think that it's just something that we really, you know, hold dear and are proud of. And I think that everybody is just happy and proud that we're all able to do that and serve and sacrifice for our country. Kelly will be a physician for the Army after graduation. She's even thought about spending her career in the military. But first, she's focused on finishing her final softball season with the World Series Championship. Reporting for FSU Headlines, I'm Sam Lane.